Let's create some split text designs in the Silhouette Studio software program. I'll show you how to make the split text monogram style, and I'll also show you how to create this style, which is the word has been split in half, and you add your text in the middle of it. Let's start with the split monogram letter style. So click your text tool and type your letter. You can adjust the size of your letter by dragging it. Now let's change the color. Open your fill panel and select the color you would like to use. And then go to the line style panel and let's remove that red outline by clicking the transparent box. Now let's change this font. I'm using the Sophia font. Now we are going to the shape tool and pick the rectangle and just drag a rectangle shape on your letter. Now let's give that a fill color as well and remove the line. Now position your rectangle wherever you would like. If you would like a lower monogram, you can do it down here. If you want it directly in the middle, you can do it right here, or you can bring it up just a little and do it towards the top. That's totally up to you. I'm going to put this one in the middle and then select both pieces and go to your modify panel and click on subtract. And now you have two separate pieces. I like to move it down just a little bit. That looks good. Now let's make the frame part of the letter by clicking the rectangle tool again and let's make a really thin rectangle this time. Just make it as long as you want to. I like to go just a little bit past the letter. Then let's change the color to match the letter. And let's remove that red cut line as well. And now we can just slide this rectangle up until it touches the top part of the letter. You want these two pieces to overlap. Now let's duplicate this. You can right click and copy and paste, or you can use a keyboard shortcut and position this one to where it overlaps the bottom part of the letter. And now you want to make sure that your outlines are lined up. Mine are not. So let me show you an easy way to fix this. Just open the transform panel, go to horizontal and click on the align left button and that will align your two lines. Now select the top line and the top of the letter. Go back to the modify panel and click on weld. Do the same for the bottom. Now your letter is a split monogram frame top letter. So let's add the name in the middle. Type on your text tool and type your name. Then you can adjust the size. Adjust the font. And change the colors. Let's remove that red line again. And now we have a split text design that is great for monograms. Let's do the other type of split text design, the one that is the full word that is split in two pieces. So start with your type tool 
and type your word. Adjust the size. And then let's change the font. And now let's get rid of that red line again. And then let's add a fill color. And I'm going to adjust this a little bit more. Just move it around until you get a look that you like. Now go to your rectangle tool again and make a narrow rectangle. Let's go ahead and fill that so we can see it better. Now just position this however you like. One thing I like to do is if there is an opening in a letter, like in this letter A here, I like to keep the split part below that just so you can tell what the letters are supposed to be. I think it makes it a little more readable, but you can do this however you want. So now select both pieces and go to your modify panel and subtract. And now we're going to add that outline by clicking on the rectangle tool again and making a really skinny rectangle. And let's get rid of that red line and change the color to match the words. Now let's duplicate this and put it on the bottom half of the letters. You want to make sure that your rectangle is overlapping your letters, but I like to keep the openings visible. I don't like to drag it down like that because I feel like you can't really see the letters as well as you can when it is just barely touching. Now let's make sure our lines are lined up by going to the transform panel and going to the horizontal align left. And now we've got those lined up. Let's weld our top half. Go to the modify panel and click weld. Do the same for the bottom. And then you can just drag this down a little bit. Now I wouldn't go too far because once you get too far, you can't tell what this is supposed to say. So I would keep it kind of close, but you can go far enough to where you can type something in between the two halves. Now we can add our text to the middle. Just type whatever you would like. Then change your font to whatever font you would like to use. Let's take off that red outline and fill the text color and then adjust the size of your text. Now you will notice if you pull the corner, it keeps your proportions of your original text, but if you want to drag your text out, just grab one of the side squares or the top or bottom squares. And there we go, we've got a split text word design with a text in the middle there's many uses for this split text design. Give it a try and just have fun with it.